obviously tough for joining us. Um, did you deserve anything out of the game today, do you think? What do you think? I think uh, the importance of the game. Um, first half we played well, the first half of the first half we played very well especially. Had a few chances and then we didn't really get going and we gave Norwich the initiative to get back in the game. And in the second half, I think by the 60th minute, we thought, right, it's not going to be our day. And we decided, I think, as a team, sometimes you have a mentality as a team to try and say, all right, we make sure they don't score. Maybe we sat back uh, too deep, too early and invited pressure and after ball, after ball into our box, which I think the lads, Gregsy did well, the back five, the midfield players getting blocks in. I think it was one too many balls into our box in the end and we've come undone, which is devastating for us because it would have been a massive point here for us. Yeah, you gave the ball away too much, didn't you? They never yeah. really got to grips with the midfield after the early stages. No, I don't, you know, it's, um, you don't want to point the blame at individuals. It's a team, it's a team game and as a team we weren't good enough today. But every time we've had a setback this season, we've come out stronger. It's another test for us. We've got another massive game in 10 days against Crystal Palace and if, if we win there, everything seems rosy again. So we just got to make sure uh, we do everything right from now to that game and uh, train well, make sure we get back on it and make sure we go again. Not many chances in the game. You look to me to have a very good chance yourself early oh, in the no, game. Yeah, I think, you know, if I look back, I take it with my wrong foot yeah. and maybe have a better chance of it. But as you're running in, you've got to make a quick decision. Um, I'm not exactly uh, striking. I don't know the last time I scored, can't remember. But um, yeah, we, we had a few chances early in the game. We thought we were going to have a good day, but it wasn't to be. The James Chester injury seemed to, to upset you. You'd started sort of left side and then went right mm. side and then back to left side on mm. Snodgr Snodgrass, who was a real handful mm. for all day. Did that unsettle the team? No, I don't think so. I think if you're a professional footballer, you've got to be able to adapt. Um, I'm equally comfortable either side. Um, and the manager asked me to do a do job on Snodgrass. He was getting a bit of joy crossing. I think I had to head the ball on the back post about five times when he was on the other side. So I was more than happy to go and mark him to try and stop him myself. And I think that's more my strength than heading. Um, so I had to try to do my best on him. I feel, I think I did well on him. He didn't cause too many problems after that, but it wasn't enough because we lost the game. Yeah, what happened on their goal? Um, I think, to be honest, he was free. We had the first corner. The center, normally we're, we're marked up because we made subs. No one knew who was meant to be marking the centre half. The first corner, he was free, nearly got a header. The second, I've waited myself to see who's going to pick him up. I've come off the post to mark him. He big centre half, he heads it and it goes in where I come off the post. It's just one of those things where if you stay on the post and he heads it in, you, you, you're, you, people ask questions, why wasn't he marked? And then if you go out and he heads it in, it's just one of those things. we we got to be better as a team, uh, better organised and make sure that we know who's picking up who because um, you, we can't be picking up other people's men in the last minute of the game. What does this result do today? Because, I mean, coming into the game, Norwich are under all sorts of pressure, but they've come level with you in the table. Yeah, well, I think everyone seems to overanalyse, especially in the Premier League, uh, we know what, what we're in for. We're in to stay in this league. Norwich are the same as us and people seem to over-sensationalise everything these days. If you win, you're the best team in the world and if you lose, you, you're the worst team in the world. And I think that we, we as a team are somewhere in between. We're not, we're not well beaters, but at the same time, we're not a terrible team. And if you get too down when you lose or get too high when you win, that's when you come unstuck. So we just got to brush this, brush this off, get back into training on Monday and start again and I'm sure we'll be fine. A couple of big signings in the week. We saw um, big yellow play today. What have you made of the signings as, as a member of the squad? Yeah, it's brilliant, you know, when when um, when new players come in, uh, it always gives the, the players a lift. I think when Tom came in and Jake, it gave us a lift and Curtis and Gregsy. And now we, we're trying to go up a level again, which is great from the owner to put his money in and fair play to the gaffer for bringing two quality players in today. Okay. What about yourself today? It was good to see in the team, maybe a bit of a surprise to us. When did you know you Not were Not a playing? surprise to me. I think I should be playing every week, to be honest with you. I think uh, if you look at the games I've been playing and we've won games, um, I've played in five of the six wins. So speaks for itself. I feel um, unlucky to not have been playing uh, as much as I have done this season. I thought I did well today and hopefully I can keep my place in the team. If it's any consolation, you were mine and Swanee's man of the match and we think you've had a very good season as well, Rosie, to be fair. Well, I've just got to keep going. Um, it was my dream to get back into this league and, and prove I can play at this level. Uh, from an individual point of view, I want to do well and help this team be in the Premier League next season and I, I just want to be playing as many games as I can. You want to play in the Cup next week? Well, I play every game. I, I'm a professional footballer. I want to play every game. I'm, a, I'm available for